Okay, welcome back to Henderson Settlement. We're going a little early today. Uh, instead of going at 2 o'clock, uh, just so uh, we've got a few other activities going on uh, in this building here at the community center around 1 o'clock, and, and we didn't want to uh, interrupt that. So, uh, it's welcome back. It, it's great to have you with us, and, and we are ramping up towards the Christmas season. We've already had our toy distribution. We've had our, um, we're actually going through giveaway uh, food boxes to uh, folks who are on that program uh, yesterday, today, and tomorrow, I think. So uh, that'll be wrapping up. Then we kind of, as far as operating, kind of ramp down a little bit, and folks start taking off for the holidays and, and things like that. So uh, if you try to call, uh, especially the work camp office, we get a lot of calls this time of year or some of the places, then, um, you know, probably you're going to need to leave a voice. Uh, message and and we'll get we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Not everything is going to be closed. The thrift store is going to be operating on a uh, uh, pretty regular schedule. There's going to be a few days we're going to be closed, uh, but other than that, uh, if if you can't reach anyone, please don't get frustrated with that. It's just folks are out of the office for a week or so, and and uh, we'll get back to you as soon as we get back in the office. So uh, with me today, I've got a, a couple of wonderful ladies uh, from the uh, thrift store. And uh, this is Carrie Parker, and this over here is, is Mary Buson, and, and they have um, are, are part of the group of three that works in uh, the, the thrift store and, and just have a huge, huge job, uh, especially this time of year, a different time of year when, when all of the items are coming in. So, girls, welcome. It's, it's good to, to have you with us uh, today. Now, now, Carrie, how long have you been working at Henderson Settlement total, not just the first one, because you, you worked in some other department. Five. Five years. You still you still fresh. Mm -hmm. Still fresh. You, you still we got yeah. You won't have to you're not you're not an old chicken. Mm -hmm. no. Now Mary now, on the other hand, how long have you been working here? I'm an old chicken and now yeah. I'll be here fifteen years. <laughs> well well now listen, old chickens is not a bad thing. <laughs> Yo, that's all right. We we like it. You don't want to be an old turkey right now, that'd be a bad time for you to have. So now so uh, have, now you worked in, have you just, you used to work some in the craft shop, is that correct? I worked in the Years craft shop. Ago. I started in the dining hall and done housing and I worked a couple of days a week after that as a receptionist in the office. Yeah, I've got about that. Yeah. So you've done a number of different things. Like, and Carrie, uh, you, of course you still, the thrift store and the craft shop mm -hmm. and stuff, you kind of go together, but um, so you still do some stuff. Or as do you care. Uh, so what are some other things you've done here besides the thrift uh, I worked one summer up here on a, a Bell Whitley program, but I've done the daycare and I've done housekeeping in this building. Yeah. And then when I got hired on, I've done housekeeping for yeah. four years. Yeah. You did a good job there. Thank Both you. of them. And, and we appreciate you. So, um, and, and y'all have, a, just, and like I said, it's just a really, really um, big job down there. And uh, one, one of the frustrating things I, from my experience and having been or around the thrift store and, and uh, sorting stuff is, is it feels like you know you go through sorting a lot of things and you feel like man we're making good progress you start to see a empty space open up and then loads come in which is a great thing uh, and, and it, then you feel like well you know everything we got figured out is covered back up again so yeah. but that's a good thing yeah it's, but that's mentally dealing with that you know, that's <laughs> absolutely good. so um just a, just a quick question for both of you do uh What's what's perhaps the perhaps the the um, the thing that we we get the least that you feel like dealing with folks coming in and looking for them that we need the most that perhaps we get the least but we we need the most. Can it be like house furniture? Household items and things like that. The new furniture, all that stuff. Yeah, yeah. What towels. Towels. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's a good one actually. Yeah. And towels. So and, we get them like a lot in five minutes. Yeah, they get gone fast. Yeah, both of those. Yeah. Um, how about in the in the clothing range? Is there, is there you know, for example, men's jeans or something? Yeah. I mean, what what would you say? Men's and little boys. And yes. little boys. We get a lot of women's out, of women's. which is good. We you don't know, keep sending those. We appreciate that. Um, but uh, so just men's and boys. Yeah. Well, that's good. Good information. Now, um, you know, we really appreciate everybody that brings everything in and. Um, as we mentioned before, we now our toy distribution through the community outreach program uh, has completed. They've gone through that, but we are still distributing toys through through the first one. Now we don't get a whole lot of those items, um, but we do get some, and and um, we don't give those away. We we sell those at a reduced cost so that folks who 
uh, maybe weren't able to go to the um, toy distribution through community outreach, they can purchase those items at a really low cost, typically, and, and uh, be able to provide those uh, items for, for their family. So um, how's that been going with toys coming into us this year? Uh, it has been extremely slow compared to other years, and yeah, there's still time. There's still time. Folks want to bring it in or send it, send in. it in. Yeah, we can still do that, and uh, and that's that's really good. Now, for for near the the Christmas holiday season, ooh, mm -hmm. man, what uh, what what kind of the, what are beginning? Let's say next week, Monday. Um, we're open typically Monday through Saturday, 9 a.m. to uh, 1 p.m. and on Tuesday and Thursdays we stay open until 6 p.m. actually. But for the next two weeks, from Monday the 18th, I think it is somewhere around there, uh, till uh, January 2nd, well, of course we're going to be closed on Christmas uh, Monday, Monday for Christmas, and New Year's Day Monday for that's as close as those follow on a Sunday. But what's the what's the schedule? Do you remember what the schedule is off the top of your head for those two weeks? We are closed on December 22nd, Friday. Yeah. Saturday the 23rd, uh -huh. Monday the 25th, and then Monday, January 1st. Okay, so every other day will be, we'll be a pretty, pretty normal schedule. They may be some of those later evening schedules that go to six, perhaps. Not sure about that. I'll be closing at three yeah, on those got, days. So yeah, that's right. Yeah, there's uh, a few people taking vacation, so it ought to be one person here, so we'll be closing at 3 p.m. instead of stay. But that's for only that week. That week. So, um, you might want to call and check with us if you're looking to come later in the day on Tuesday or Thursday and see if we're going to be open. Um, but uh, just to be sure, but on, on that particular week, the 18th, is it? I think it is, or the week after Christmas, following Christmas. It's the week following Christmas. Yeah, yeah. The week of Christmas. So the 25th, we're closed, and then the 26th, we'll open back up, or the 27th, we'll open back up. And the 27th and I guess the 30th, that Tuesday and Thursday, only open till 3 that Thursday, uh, Tuesday and Thursday. So, um, so girls, now listen, now we've, we've got all that pertinent information out of the way. Let's get down to the, to the really good stuff. Now, if you had to name one person, who would be your favorite supervisor here at Henderson? <laughs> you just had to name one. I just, you just throw one out there. <laughs> Oh, that's not looking good. You know, well, if you're going to be that way, boy, that's, that's, that's cold blood. I was, I was trying to. But we love you, Jerry. I was we love yeah. Oh, he feels that way. It, it really, I'm feeling the you know, Christmas season. It's just, I'm not feeling the Christmas blood. Right. No, seriously. So, um, what, what is your own on Christmas? What um, do you do for dinner? What's, what's your favorite item for Christmas food? I make Oreo pudding. Oreo pudding. It's awesome. Oh man, that sounds good. Mm -hmm. I've never had that. It's Oreos, cream cheese, cool whip, and vanilla pudding. Man, I love awesome. cream cheese too. That, that sounds outstanding. Mm -hmm. That sounds good. I've got you there. Nice turkey. Turkey. <laughs> turkey yeah. yeah. So you're a turkey or a ham person? I do. Christmas. On Christmas, we do ham. Yeah. Thanksgiving, we do turkey. Yeah. I'm a turkey guy through and through. <laughs> I like the ham on the I like the Italian right. ham too. But turkey, it's got to be turkey on Thanksgiving. Got me turkey on Christmas. Mm -hmm. you know, that's kind of you know why I got this. You know, um, <laughs> anyway. Um, so, um, but yeah. But so, oh man, that Oreo thing sounds good. Mm -hmm. So, what's your favorite kind of dessert type thing? Chocolate cake. Chocolate cake. Oh, okay. you know I like chocolate cake, but I just ain't crazy about chocolate cake. Now, my sister, I mentioned that uh, the last uh, about Thanksgiving, she makes this ugly duckling cake, mm -hmm. and and I, Casey asked me. To get the recipe for that, and I've yet to do that. I keep forgetting, but that is oh, I love that stuff. But my mom makes this like this cherry um, um, pie type thing. It's not really. It's, it's in a it's in a dish about like that, and it's got um, cherry delight. Yeah, cherry delight. Yeah. Oh, that is that so is good. Really it's good. Got the graham crackers oh, yeah. and the, and oh, the filling. Oh, that's man, that is good stuff. Mm -hmm. I love that stuff. Right. Really good. Well, girls, anything you want to add uh, before we turn you loose? Nothing. <laughs> well, I really yes. Yeah. So if you're out there and you and you want to bring uh, a load of items to us, whether that's household, uh, which obviously we need men's items, which obviously we need uh, all items as far as that go, we need it. Uh, we just want you to stop bringing something. Uh, um, but uh, so all those items. Um, but it's really helpful if if you call and schedule that ahead if possible, uh, just so we're prepared for you. 
uh, we, we can do that, uh, as well as, you know, we, we don't have the opportunity of the staffing to be able to um, wash or repair items, so if you uh, bring items, it's really, really appreciated if, if they're already in good, usable condition, that, that helps a lot. And, uh, you know, also furniture and, and appliances, just about anything that you can think of that, that uh, you would use around the house or on your person, then, then we can use it. Dig next, whatever. You know, we can, as long as it's in good, usable, uh, not in need of washing and repair condition, then, then we can we can use that. So um, if you'd like to, to uh, contact us to bring something in, just call us, uh, Henderson Settlement, 606-337-3613, extension um, 314, and we'll set that up with you and, and get, that, get that started. Or you can dial extension 306, which takes you directly into the thrift store. So, girls, we appreciate you. And we thank you for uh, coming in and spending a few minutes with us today. Thank okay. Merry Christmas. That would be Christmas. Oh, oh, look at that. Throwing out that Merry that was Christmas. Sweet. Wasn't that nice? That is so nice. All right, now, Casey. Yes. Um, we're having a we're having a little issue today. Uh, in past weeks with uh, security issues. We are. Yes. So I need down at down at the work camp office. I have my own security detail, and uh, he's uh he's, he's a pretty Pretty, pretty active guy. Yeah. This is Blue. I want to introduce you to Blue. He's in, he's been sitting in the work camp office for a few years, and and he's he's a big talker. Yes, he is. And uh, and Blue, he's he's real festive. He's all worked up about Christmas this year. He's got on his decorations, got his Santa hat. He's ready to go. Oh, Blue here is so Blue. Um, what kind of uh, season has it been in the work camp office? Yeah. I would have thought the same thing. It has definitely been a struggle this year with Laura breaking her leg and being out. And, and I know you saw a lot of uh, a lot of uh, tense, shall we say, moment. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Absolutely, Blue. I, I agree with that. Blue is kind of a low talker. If you can't hear him out there, it's okay. I've got it. I'll kind of help you out with that. But uh, yeah, Blue. There's a uh, yeah. There's there's been you've been uh, pretty active. This summer, trying to deal with people coming in, wanting to talk to somebody, and there being no secretary around, and, and that's like, hey, Blue, now watch it now. Easy, easy, easy. Yeah, I thought he was getting worked up there. Yeah, he's putting. Well, up he his, has a little trouble helping yeah. us on the computer because yeah. he. Yeah, well, he don't. He doesn't do. That's why he's on security. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He, he's got a good yeah. punch, but yeah. he's, he's, he's he he's got it covered. Blue, can't help on the computer. Blue is something else. Now listen, Blue. Now, um, I've been told, and just from personal experience, I I, I kind of tend to believe. It. But um, I hear you are the world record holder for a staring contest. Yes, that you just, you just, man, you get in a staring contest with Blue, you are losing. You are not going to win that. I sit at my desk and he stares me down. I cannot get him to blink. He can't. Look. Yeah. Oh, man, Blue, you, you, you are a real talent, real talent. But this, now settle down. Fell down because we, we want to move on to some other things. You stick around though. You don't want anybody kind of busting into the room. If you do, you can't take care of that light work for us. You handle that for us. You got it? Good. Excellent. All right. So, so Blue, um, we're going to talk to Casey and, and you kind of just kind of keep your eyes open. <laughs> <laughs> keep your eyes open. Woo hoo. Woo. Man, that was a good one. Anyway, uh, so Casey, good to have you back. Yeah, good to look, be look here. Like you got your kind of well, it was cold out this morning. I even I had to wear my Elmer Fudd hat oh, yeah. last couple of days because it's I, been so darn cold. I see that. I see that. I, I like this thing is warm. That's that's a, I love. That's it good even good has one. the ear flaps. Oh, it does. Yeah. So well, I mean, flaps down, flaps look. down, ready to go. Yeah, yeah you betcha. That's but, good look on you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. I, I like covers it. up my face. Yes, Can't is. ask for much more than yeah. that. No. Well, no comment there. Blue. Keep it easy. Don't make her. Don't get her upset. Keep that to yourself. All right. That's now, okay. Blue can say whatever he wants. Oh, yeah, well, yeah. And and Blue has been helping you with the, the new server. Yes. Been working on the server, trying to get that set up. I've been uh, struggling a little bit, but I'm making a little progress today. I think we're going to get that technology. Technology. technology system. Yeah. Man. Woo. It's good when it works. And it's could be bad when it works. <laughs> <laughs> when it it's works. Horrible when it don't. Work. <laughs> but uh, so now, so so that was a big. Big thing to get that in and, it was. and get that, that going. At least it's here and we're working on it. it absolutely did. It cost us about $4,200 for, for that yeah. server, um, which is a big expense, especially this time of year. Things are a little bit slow. 
Um, but uh, so if you wanted to um, consider helping us with the offsetting the expense of that, certainly. Any donation towards that is, is well. That? And you mentioned donations. We had our Giving Tuesday and Why Not Wednesday. You got some, you and got some uh, information on that? I, I do. And, and we also are, you know, Why Not December? I mean, you know, come on. Yeah. Just keep it coming in. What, what, what's that, Blue? What? what yeah. Listen, listen. No. Stop. Calm down, Blue. Calm down. Keep it. Just eat. Face forward. All right. Sorry about that, Casey. Okay. Not a problem. Yeah. Um, we don't have all the numbers in yet. Yeah. But as of right now, we are around $43,000 came in for Good. Giving Tuesday. Good. Outstanding. We thank you, folks. Awesome. We really appreciate it. Yeah. So the end of, we need to close out the end of year big. And, yeah. and so, you know, keep coming in. We're getting our Christmas gifts coming in from people. Yeah. Oh, and, yeah. That helps a lot. And, um, you know, people divide up their funds at the end of the year and give to different missions and, sure. and that sort of thing. Yeah. So that's all going really good. And, yeah. um, you know, so, and we have the thing about giving, I didn't bring the cards today. If they want to give Henderson Settlement as a gift, we have that Christmas card still online that you can print off and give to people and send us a donation in their name. Yeah. And uh, those will all get listed in the uh, newsletter. Yeah. When I, I'm going to have to have a whole newsletter just on. That's outstanding. And, uh, That's great. You know, giving in honor and in, in memory. Honor of yeah. That's yeah. outstanding. Yeah, it's a great way to. to what? Oh. That he says you can give in him honor of him. Give in honor of Blue. Would that be so good? Listen, you are always thinking. That's what I like about you, Blue. You you may not talk a lot, but when you do talk, it I mean it's it, real it hits right information. It's right. Right, I mean it's top level, high dollar stuff. Yes, thank you, Blue. We appreciate that. And Blue has a connection with you know who at Christmas time oh, too. Oh, yeah, well, I didn't want to try to get. That after. Well, that's why he wears the hat. Yeah. And stuff too. So you know what benefits blue may benefit you too. Oh, oh, oh. That, I, I, oh, what benefits blue might benefit you too. That's that, that, you took, that to come off the top of your head. It you? did. It did. That's from Casey, being I, out the cold. That, you, you, I got frozen brain cells in there yeah. that are thawing out. Yeah. You're gonna you're gonna keep it up, and we're gonna keep you around. Oh, 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 that would be nice. You want to keep coming up with stuff like that? I, well, I'll see what I can do. It's yeah. good to be useful. Oh, it's going to be oh, it's big year ahead. 2018 is going to be just amazing. Lots of new it's things. Beautiful. Yep. Okay, so any more reporting on, on that? that no, not right now. Uh, it'll be a little while before we get the money in from the advance and sure. from, you know, uh, and we're still getting them in the mail. Yeah. Uh, we'll continue to update you on that. Mail's a little slow sometimes. You know how that goes. Well, yeah. <laughs> and then we'll have Blue's fun coming up here, you know, in well, honor of Blue that we'll have to have a report oh, yeah, of that. Yeah, yeah. If you want to donate in honor of Blue, listen, he will appreciate that. You would not believe. I mean, seriously, the poor thing puts up a Jerry day in, day out. Office. So, He's I mean, he puts up. He never he leaves. Up, he sits there in the office. Entertains and, work and campers he, coming he and does, going. He never, he's 24 7. He is there in the work camp office making sure things are. Easy, smooth, ready to go. So he spends more time in the office than you do, is what you're saying. Oh, well, yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> no question about that. <laughs> you got that right. Okay, so so no no more reporting on monies or anything no, like that? No, uh, we had a good Christmas season with the, the toy sale. Uh -huh. That went really well. Yes, it did. And um, what else do we have going on? Oh, our lights, lights and our Christmas inflatable lights, stuff. Campus and inflatables, yeah, we've got it all decorated up, which is nice. It's just Wonderful. Uh, um, we had a visit at our Christmas party. Uh, oh, yeah. The and, big guy. Yeah. The big well, he wasn't like real big, but he was big for the so kids. I bet that could have been Santa. That... I mean, there's something funny about that. Every funny time, about what? Every time you say Santa, I'm hearing bells. I'm, I'm beginning to think I'm going to get some medication. I'm. Thinking yes. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. There's a little. There's a. There's a bell loose somewhere. Right yeah, here. there yeah. could be that too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah he keeps saying where to deliver yeah. the truckload of coal. Yeah. Yeah. yeah well, it's. Uh, yeah. I, I think out behind the maintenance building is probably a good I, place. Me and Santa are having a good talk later. Have him? Yeah. I'm, I about got him convinced. You know, he can keep his coal. Okay. Not quite there yet, but I think I'm getting. Bring him book. What's that book? Yes, I agree. Thank you, Blue. I know I am I am one special, wonderful individual. Why would you blue? Oh, I totally agree. You blue. Listen. Oh my god. You're the best blue. 
you are the best. Eyes wide open. Okay, so, all right, so let's move into the uh, craft shop portion. Yes, I gave things. you the frilly stuff. You got the frilly stuff. Yeah, I appreciate that because I'm, <laughs> I'm a frilly kind of guy. Yes. So these, you know, look at here. It's cold out. Won't be a cold winter. Look at that. But I feel like we should have some music playing while you're showing those. Oh, it's free. Oh, that was free. That don't cost you a thing. That's all on the house. So these are available in the craft shop. We've got a lot of different colors. But I don't want to. You know that right there. That, that's not. That's not me right there. It's, you know it's nice. Let's just put pink. Blue stop. Pink, you know, blue stop it, blue. <laughs> what kind of comment was that? <laughs> We're out live to all the people. Oh my god! Across the country. But these are available a lot of different colors. Got some Christmas colors, Christmas colors, and things like that. And and these are available uh, in our craft shop. And and if you'd be interested in one or multiple of these, let us know. I think she said those were. Six or eight dollars, I can't remember. But anyway, um, six or eight dollars, one or the other, uh, in the craft shop, and we can get you some of those. Now, one of the items that, that we started getting last year uh, were some um, Henderson Settlement three quarter sleeve, somebody call them a baseball shirt. Yeah, oh, are you used to play baseball with DJ Blue? Man, I bet you was. You want, oh, catch, you play catch. Yeah, you like to start the pitcher down. <laughs> Blue, you're a real card, that's what you are. A mess. You're a real mess. Anyway, so uh, this is, uh, we've had some standard colors. We still had all the colors we had, but this is our new shirt, a new color. It's pink and white, and as you can uh, see out there. Oh, goes but, with that ruffle but thing. But this, it, how about that? It does. Look, look at that. That would go nice. But these are available in the uh, Henderson Settlement Craft Shop, and these are really nice. Uh, size is small, up to 2X, I think it is. And, and these are, I can't remember, I think they're $16 perhaps or 15 something like that. But a really nice shirt, good material, and, and just really comfortable. The, the ladies that have saw these so far just really, really like those. Um, and and uh, we also got a, a blue on blue. Yeah, blue. We had you That's in his blue. favorite. <clears throat> blue is the blue favorite, no doubt. A blue on blue, and, and a really, again, really nice. It enters the settlement. Uh, found in 1925 on, so they're not dated with a year, so that you have to. Oh, 2017's over. Can't wear that shirt anymore. Don't have to worry about that. Uh, and then we have. Uh, I'm not sure if this one was one we already had in the craft shop or not. I was thinking it was, but perhaps not. And then we've got this uh, blue and gray, which is really, really nice. Really I like that. Uh, and then, of course, in honor of blue again, we have a a blue and white one. Blue and white, really nice. And, and again. We've got a number of other colors. We've got a purple and white. We've got some other, uh, got a red and a gray, uh, and, and a green and white that's really, really nice. Uh, just a, a number of different colors uh, in, in the craft shop. And if you're interested in any of those, just contact us through email. Uh, and uh, on, you can find that on our, our Facebook page here, or call us, or message us in here. And, and we're happy to ship those out to you. You can get those out to you before Christmas if you want to get one. For yourself or for someone else. So, um, but we just mailed out a handful the other day. Just mailed out a whole bunch of them. Yeah. So uh, that's that's great. So, Casey, anything anything new you want to add to us? Anything you want to throw? Us? Oh, I didn't forget one thing. We still have the Santa's mailbox over oh, near the okay. entrance to the gym. That if you want to bring your kids by and put want to put what, that what kind of mailbox? Santa's mailbox. Put that letter in there, and they'll get a response. Yes, they will. So that's right outside the gym. Just open the front, stick the letter in there, close her back, and you are in business. Yes, you are. So anything, anything else you want to add? The, the only thing that I have that's really exciting is I'm, I'm getting a new heater in greenhouse four. Oh, yeah, man. yeah, it's it's a little cold in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And that's heater. not good though when you're trying to grow plants at the beginning yeah. of the year. No, no, gotta gotta keep it warm. So uh, yeah, gotta that's my it. big excitement. I mean, you know, if there's something to get excited about. Yeah. Heat in the greenhouse. Is heat it? in the greenhouse. I was there playing in the dirt this morning in, in one of the heated ones yeah. because it was just too cold. Yeah. It gets cold pretty fast. We were in the flat. teens last yeah. night. Yeah. At pretty, 18. Pretty oh, yeah. It's still cold out there this morning. It is. Yeah. Uh, yes, yeah. So, that's, so that's, a, that's it for you? Yeah. Well, yeah. oh, that's my excitement. Just greenhouse. Greenhouse all the way. Yeah. That's the way I am. What's that? Oh, you, you got something? What's that? Yeah. Well, you'd like to tell everybody have a Merry Christmas. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. And a, and a safe and Happy New Year. Okay. Oh, oh, and he's looking Blue. forward to next year's yeah, work yeah, camp. Yeah. You're looking into the future. Looking forward to next year's work camp. You want to tell folks out there that 
Yeah, tell them if they want to schedule with us, contact us. We still got open uh, spaces available in the summer, spring, and fall. So yeah, woo! You have done an outstanding job. I think job. we found a new cohort. I think we found a new cohort. You might be in. If I'm not able to make it, you might fill in for me. Would you be interested in doing that? You wouldn't. No. Well, look, listen. I got to tell you, you're good at your job, and we'll just leave you right where you are. We don't want to put too much pressure on you, that kind of thing. But. Blue, we appreciate you being with us today. It's been it's been great, and uh, I hope you folks appreciate Blue joining us because he don't get out much. He don't do oh, this kind of thing, <laughs> and uh, he, uh, he he really worked up. I can see he got himself all dolled up for us, and all that. that's a good thing. That's a good thing. Casey, as always, my friend. Yep, it's great having you with us. Yes, and, good to be and here. And good job. to be seen. And we appreciate you. We also appreciate each and every one of you folks. Out there. As I say, practically every week, I think we just cannot do it without. You. You have made such a difference in the lives of the people of this area, these communities, and, and the folks that we touch in a lot of different ways, and all that is made possible because of you. Whether you sit in church and you pray for us, whether you sit at home and pray for us, whether you send donations or monies or whatever the case to us, it all makes a difference. It all matters. You matter. You make a difference. And we thank God for you every day because we just can't do it without you. And with uh, that, I guess we want to close out this week, yeah. and, and we'll be in touch uh, a few times over the next couple of weeks, probably maybe live, we'll put something up for you, and uh, we wish you all a very Merry Christmas. Merry God Christmas. Christmas.